and I think that you guys would agree, that uh, we love people in our life who follow through with what they say they're going to do. I found that in parenting, I have three, my oldest is 12, um, I have a nine, getting ready to be 10 year old, and a six year old, that one of the hardest things for me as a parent, one of the most frustrating things is when my children tell me they're going to do something and then they don't do it. But I think that probably all of us in the room can identify people in our life who follow through with what they say they're going to do. On the flip side of that, I bet all of us in the room also have people in our life who we know do not follow through. They say they're going to do something, and they don't do it. So on the count of three, I want you to yell out the name of that person in your life that, I'm just, just kidding. Today we're celebrating Easter. And we're going to talk about a man who followed through on what he said he was going to do. And his name is Jesus. His name is Jesus. The name above all names. The Son of God. The Prince of Peace. The Lord of Lords. The King of Kings. His name is Jesus. All that we are here doing today is contingent upon Jesus doing what he said he was actually going to do. Matthew chapter 17 verse 22 through 23 says this after they gathered again in Galilee Jesus said pause for a second just so you know this was before this happened Jesus like Babe Ruth calling his shot was about to call his shot he was about to say something and follow through with it this isn't after this is before Jesus says the Son of Man is going to be betrayed into the hands of his enemies. He will be killed, but on the third day, he will be raised from the dead. And the disciples were filled with grief. Jesus, that's what Jesus said. He called his own shot. He followed through with it because if he hadn't, we wouldn't be here celebrating what he's done, what he's done. Amen? We wouldn't be here celebrating the good news of Jesus that the tomb was empty and that he is alive. 